Hello guys, welcome back. My name is Ariane and today we're looking into a day in my life as an artist while in quarantine. Because of the virus that shall not be named, I just wanted to let you know that I recorded this video on April 2nd and if things change from then to now that it's being posted, well, I hope things have changed for the better. On a side note, before we begin, you will hear a lot of clicking on this voiceover that is just my boyfriend playing video games, so uh, sorry about that. Okay, on with the video. I start most of my mornings around 8 to 8.30. My schedules do change and cycle, but I never wake up later than 10 or earlier than 6 a.m. But the most important part about my mornings is that I like them to be slow and calm. The first thing I do is take my dog out for a walk. Her name is Whiskey and I'm working on a video about her, so do subscribe if you want to see that video. I used to not enjoy this activity all too much, but now that I literally can't go out and have no reason to, this is the only thing that brings me to the outside world and it's a nice quiet time away from being trapped in my house. Me and my partner are staying at a last minute Airbnb at the moment and the space is pretty limited but it works well nevertheless. The next thing I do is work out. Now, I realize at this point in the video, the next part will sound a bit like a flex, but I promise you, I only do this to stay sane and not run around killing people, so bear with me. I did yoga today, but sometimes I'll also do hit, or some days I'll go out running in the afternoon. I need, I really need, to work out at least five times a week or my anxiety and stress goes off the roof, especially in times like this. So I really recommend it if anybody is experiencing this negative emotions. Then I meditate. I use this app called Smiling Mind and it's awesome. I'm currently taking a 10 day program for stress management and boy do I need it. <laughs> Once I'm done, I'm ready to make myself a coffee. While well, my coffee gets made, I hop on the shower and when I return, the coffee is at a temperature that won't burn my tongue off, which is wonderful. I'm the only cook of the house, so I make us both breakfast. We like eating large breakfast so that we won't be snacking on terrible food throughout the day. Today, I made oats or cereal with berries, bananas and a veggie sandwich and I had it with coffee and orange juice. Like I said, I like my mornings slow and calm, so I will watch some trivial random YouTube videos while having breakfast with my partner, mostly to relax and have fun. Once I'm worked out, meditated, fed and caffeinated, I'm ready to kick butt. It's been like three hours since I woke up and that's how slow I like to make my mornings. I set up all of my work gear on this tiny table that we have and if you want a breakdown of what gear I use while traveling, I made a video about it and the link is in the description. Today I'm working on a webtoon comic that I'm going to be entering for a short story contest that webtoon launched a month ago. You'll be able to read that comic on April 30th, so I'll make sure to leave the link to that in the description as well. I've been wanting to get published by Webtoons for a long, long time now, so I'm putting a lot of effort into this comic and I worked on three pages total today. This took me around three and a half hours and I've been meaning to make a tutorial about the process for this channel because I know a lot of people want to start making comics and they don't know how to so I'm planning on doing that soon. Comics are tough and take so much time but I try to take that work and turn it into a meditative and calming experience. If I've learned anything in life is that you have to make your struggles into enjoyable habits or at least try your best. Now it's around 2 p.m. and I have a video I have to edit for this channel, so I thought since it's a short time lapse, I can squeeze in the editing and rendering before making lunch at 3 p.m. Today for lunch I made noodle soup, one of my favorite and least complicated meals to prepare, and I also made rice and lentil mushroom tacos. For dessert, we had some leftover cake I made for our anniversary since we couldn't go out to celebrate this week. After lunch, I relax. I might take a nap or watch one of our favorite series on Netflix, a movie, or read a book. I also take some time to just enjoy my time with my partner and make our bond stronger. 
Around 6.30 is when I usually work on commissions, if I have any. But since the world is going crazy, well, purchasing art is not on top of a lot of people's minds at the moment. So instead, I'm working on creating content for my Instagram. Because the best way to get new clients, commissions, and or a following is to create amazing content. Do note that at this point in the day, I'm already wearing my pajama shorts. Throughout this whole situation, the best thing I've found has been to stay positive and strong. Sure, we all are struggling, times seem crazy, everything sounds stressful, and the future is more uncertain than what it usually is. But if you're alive today and even have the time to watch this video, I'm sure you're doing just fine. You will be fine and I promise you, you got this. Whatever the future holds, you will make it through. When I'm done working on content or commissions, I will make myself dinner. Then I'll go out on a long walk with my dog and my partner to enjoy little outside moments. Always keeping in mind social distancing, by the way. I didn't record this part just because I didn't want to be holding a camera throughout the whole relaxing part of my day. So here is this animation instead. Around 8.30 or 9, and depending on the time of the week, this will be the time when I record either voiceovers for my art videos, record a voiceover for my podcast, or record an ASMR video for my ASMR channel. Today, I am actually recording this voiceover for this video. So, hello there. My day ends at around 10.30 or 11, and after that, I might be awake for another hour or two, and then it's time to go to bed. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, I hope it brought you a bit of joy or helped you relax. I know it wasn't a super action packed day, but this is what life looks like at the moment and I think it's good enough. Please remember to stay safe, stay home, clean your hands and practice social distancing. You will be alright, as will all of us. I send you a lot of love and I'll see you in the next video. Well, this is my outro. Outro? Out, out, outro. This is my outro and I'm supposed to tell you to subscribe to my channel and you can choose to ignore this. Oh, and also you can you can uh, like and comment and stalk me and support me on Patreon. Yeah, that's all that it says here. <laughs>